Expectations are uh, never worried about this topic, that is ENSO. And in many competitive examinations, these topics have been asked. Now, what is this ENSO? Your first time listen to this. So, it stands for L Nano Sudden Oscillation, and that is very important thing. Please note the full form of this L Nano Sudden Oscillation, as I have written here. This is the full form. And uh, it is very important because actually derived from the Spanish, and this word means a very important thing that you all know baby Christ. Mm -hmm. Now, you're thinking baby Christ? Why this baby Christ is very important for the geography, right? So this is actually from away from the topic. Let me tell you about why this is happening. And uh, let me tell you what is, first of all, what is Southern Oscillation means. I'll tell you about this El Nino. What, what is Southern Oscillation means SO. So as Southern Oscillation is actually stands the the currents. Like have you all studied in the class, from the class 5th, class 6, uh, you all are uh, known about the topic that is known as Ocean Current. Now that Ocean Current which has been felt from the Pacific Ocean to the Indian Ocean. Like in Pacific Ocean, when you talk about in this degree, that's it. Like I have written PO. So this Pacific Ocean in the Tethet area means 18 degrees south to 149 degree west. At this area, the pressure is very high of the ocean current. Ocean current pressure is very high in this part. In this, when you find, uh, find the latitude and the longitude in this degree, you will find that 18 degrees south is where, uh, 18 degrees south to 149 degree west is a very high pressured area that is known as Tethet part of the southern uh, of this Pacific Ocean. Whereas to the Darwin, Darwin is actually located in this uh, Australia and this position uh, of Indian Ocean, right? So th there you will find low pressure. There is low pressure of the ocean currents. I'm talking about the ocean currents, not anything. Like many things are responsible for ocean currents, also very important. So this ocean current here is a stand for the L Nano Southern. So this what happened, this type of is a special type of uh, ocean current. And this is uh, Flowing from where? To the Pacific Ocean from the Tethet region to the Darwin in Australia in the Indian Ocean. So always remember, when you go to the uh, eastern part, you will find the low pressure in the ocean current, whereas in the western part, you will find more and more pressure. So I'll then stand for the baby Christ and this is th this topic is very important. Because whenever we talk about this topic, uh, this uh, comes uh, too much importance. But this is important because there, nobody is giving importance. When everybody will start giving it importance, this will be no more a good topic to study. But now it is very important because this is a new type of ocean current which have been uh, which have been found in our book, right? So uh, from many days I thought that let's make a video on this special topic. So there is nothing more than this. I want to tell you that from this region, from the Tethet, like the in Pacific Ocean, which is located at the 18 degrees south to the 149 degree west, and when, whereas from the Darwin at the Australia, which is located somewhere in the Indian Ocean at the 12 degree 30 minute 30 minute south here, yeah, 131 uh, degree east. This region is very important because in this, when you go to the Indian Ocean, you will find low pressure and they, when you go in Pacific Ocean, find high pressure. Now, this is a Spanish word, as you all know, El Neno. Now, why, why this word have been chosen? You all might be thinking. Now, this is a long story, when you, I will tell you, from the two to five years, there is a, uh, like, there is one country in the South America that is known as Peru. So, to when the replacement of the Peruvian current came, Peruvian current means the, the current of the ocean current which was found on the coast of the Peru. So the, uh, to exchange, to replace that current, this new, uh, new current have been started that is known as El Nino Southern Oscillation. So this actually start at the time of the Christmas. So that's why it is known as, um, that when you go this blue box, whenever uh, I have hands here, and uh, when you talk about this blue box, there is El, El Nino. Actually, and this is the most important thing. And I have told you that two to five years, and uh, this oscillation is actually, so I have told you what is Southern Oscillation. So in the uh, ENSO right now, now I am going to talk about the jet stream. This is very important because this is also in the blue box and this come, this topics come first in your books. Right now, uh, this is on the 28th page and that jet, jet stream is very important. Now let me tell you what is jet stream. Jet stream is a type of stream means it is a narrow belt. Now what is that is very important. So this is narrow belt and that is very important. Narrow belt, always remember. And it is, uh, it is above the troposphere means it is uh, just be inside the troposphere because troposphere start from the 10 to this is 12,000 meters means around 12, uh, 12 kilometers so of course it is in troposphere so that is very important and this was the main thing and this is not responsible many people ask for this is responsible for the monsoon no because monsoon have been uh, not came from the 2000 meters above always remember the clouds are remaining here so that is below the troposphere. So that's why rain is not even being a part of being jet stream. Jet stream is a type of narrow belt formation which is above the sky at the troposphere at the 1200 meter. And there's nothing else to tell me, uh, tell you in this about this. And this of course, the speed, the speed. This is a very fast speed here being found. 
In summer, it is found that 110 km per hour speed have been found in the, gyro, uh, in the jetty stream. Whereas when you uh, talk about you in winters, there is 184 km per, per hour speed have been found. So this was very important thing and uh, this was all about the jetty stream. Let me write a solution. The sudden oscillation is a type of the oscillation which is found in the part of the region of the Pacific Ocean to the Indian Ocean and that is a region of 18 degrees south to the 149 degree west and whereas Indian in the Indian Ocean, Darwin and Darwin is located in Australia that is located at Indian Ocean at the 12 degree 30 minutes south and the 131 degree east and that is all about El Neno means baby Christ. There is nothing more to tell you about this. And when we talk about the jetty stream, it is a narrow belt formation at the, above the sky that is known as troposphere, means above the 10, uh, 10 kilometers, all about troposphere. So in that 12, uh, 12 kilometers, 12,000 meters it is written. Whereas at the best, uh, in the winters, it is, it is not best. The winter, here it is stands for the winter, let me put a star marker, otherwise they will think. This is an exception, right? So in the winters, it is found at 100, uh, 184 km per hour speed and whereas in the summers you find 110 km per hour speed and this was all about I want to tell you today. So thank you for watching this video. Please if you have watched this video, please do not forget to like our video, like, comment and share. That is very important. Please do not forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. Please follow us on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. I am everywhere, right? So I am also on the, uh, you can follow on my you can go to my website also and you can follow me whenever you want <laughs> right so please first of all if you are new to our channel please do not